owns Chad Milner Trains. $12,000 Lexian Selected Yearling Sale Purchase. Number two is Scratch. Number three, Holiday Harlot. This is a homebred for the back stable. Holiday Road Philly out of the Duke of York Mare Harlequin Sealster. John Backs Trains, Matt Backs Drives. This is the fifth foal from the half sister to Hemi Sealster, who made $675,000 past Good Times Champion. Number four is Miss Congeniality, homebred for Tom and Elizabeth Rankin. Shane Weber trains, Trevor Henry drives, Cadabra Philly out of the Balanced Image Merit World Class Image. This is the full sister to our first class, last year's OSS Super Final Champion. Number five, Teddy's Little Angel, Paul McDonnell drives for trainer Ted McDonnell, owner Len Gamble, who is also the breeder. Teddy's Little Angel is an Archangel Philly out of the Yankee Glide Mare Pine Knolls. Six is Kenogami Darling. Jean-Francois Reed and Claude Reed share ownership. Danny Fontaine trains Sylvain Fillion drives. So it's the first foal from the Ken Workington Mayor Profound Wisdom. She's the daughter of Justice Hall. Seven is Horde Top Temper, homebred for Paul Van Camp and Robert Van Camp. E.L. Titan Philly out of the Don Boss Vita Mayor Boston Lexi. David Ahern trains Randy Waples drives. And they're off and trotting. Field of six gets off to a pretty good beginning, but we do have a breaker in the center. That is number five, Teddy's Little Angel. Under a tight hold, Ken Ogami Darling steps out of there quickly. Into second is Holiday Harlot. Whore, temp Whore Top Temper will settle in third ahead of Blue Ribbon Gal in fourth. Racing in fifth is Miss Congeniality, and off stride is Teddy's Little Angel. Around the first turn, we had a breaker in third. That was Whore Top Temper. Opening quarter was 30 and 2. It's Ken Ogami Darling, the leader, as they go into the backstretch. Holiday Harlot in second now jumps it off and is on a break. Blue Ribbon Gal should inherit that second position as she is still trotting there comfortably and now takes over second and following right behind her, looking good as Miss Congeniality. Up the backstretch they go. And the leader continues to be Ken Ogami Darling. Racing in second, Blue Ribbon Gal. Third is Miss Congeniality. Resetting after the break, Holiday Harlot is in fourth. Then it's back to Hortot Temper in fifth. And the trailer is Teddy's Little Angel. 102 and 1, the half mile clocking. Trotting Phillies now enter the far turn. Ken Ogami Darling to Justice Hall Philly. Still has the lead, and that lead is still about three and a half lengths as they go past five eighths. Blue Ribbon Gal in second. To the outside, Miss Congeniality is looking to advance for Henry. Holiday Harlot is in fourth. They're getting a little closer to the leader now as they're about to hit three quarters, and that lead's only going to be a length and a half at the third marker in 133 and three. So Ken Ogami Darling is going to have to find a second gear as they swing into the lane. Miss Congeniality is on the outside and looking to pass the leader to take the lead now as they come to the eighth pole. Inside, it's still Ken Ogami Darling, and Ken Ogami Darling might have found that second gear and looks good here now as going to turn aside that challenge for Miss Congeniality and is going to stretch the lead back out to three to win this one nicely. Ken Ogami Darling to win it. Blue Ribbon Gal comes back on to get second. Miss Congeniality was third. Holiday Harlot was fourth. Then it was Hortop Temper and Teddy's Little Angel. 2-0, 2 flat, the time of the mile.